I think in effect you have to park park the budget considerations because if you do you just focus your entire attention on that we know we're going to have to sp uh, save 90 million pounds over the next three years to 30 million per year if that if you let that dominate your thoughts you lose sight of what you're trying to achieve in the city uh, which fundamentally for me comes down to uh, making Cardiff a, a better place to live and work and tackling the inequality that exists in the city how do I think we do that where well, we provide good jobs and good education and as part of that good jobs, it's about creating uh, the economic stimulus, the economic development, and the placemaking uh, that businesses want to, want to invest in. So it's partly about recognizing, um, recognizing the role that culture has in the economic growth of the city. So for example, we've got you know, 2016, we have over 20 million people visit Cardiff, bringing 1.2 million pounds, uh, 1.2 billion pounds of money into the city. But it's also how culture and creativity, the creative sector, creates a sense of place in Cardiff, which encourages, you know, companies, businesses, uh, to come in and invest here as well. How do you square that? Well, if you want to create good jobs, then you have to create the environment in the city uh, uh, for, for 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 good jobs to to, to flourish. Uh, there is, you know, uh, a squeeze on money, so that means we have to work. Uh, better with with our partners, uh, and and that is exactly what you're seeing in terms of how the council is working with the university sector, uh, with uh, with partners in, in in live music, in in other parts of the cultural sector, uh, recognizing that whilst we not might not have cash anymore, we've got goodwill, we've got capability, we've got assets. How can we make sure that all those are being used to best effect uh, to support the cultural sector? Absolutely, you know, there, we have to be honest, we no longer have uh, the money that in the past local government has had, but we do have that ambition and we do have that capacity to act uh, and we have that willingness to work with people. Uh, you know, I, I've stood up on several stages and said, local government often no longer has all the answers to our problems, but together, you know, everyone in the city working together probably does. Uh, so what can we do to, to maximise those those opportunities? Like take the tram shed, for example. Uh, you know, five years ago, that was a disused council building. Through working in partnership, we've turned that into the most exciting uh, venues in, in all of Wales. So what other schemes are, are, are there out there like that, that we can work together to, to deliver, you know, and create uh, a, a, a vibrant community uh, within, within parts of Cardiff? What what is clear in an age of, you know, uh, age of austerity, which is which is what it still is, you know that that the the call on public money has to be you know really rigorous rigorously tested. So uh, that being said, if there is an opportunity that is you know uh, you know a, an amazing opportunity that cannot be delivered without cash, then of course we look at it. You know, and particularly capital, uh, we're able to borrow money. Uh, that needs to be done on a prudential basis. But if there's a payback there, uh, you know, and a, and a strong case for economic growth off the back of it, then we'll certainly look at it. You do have the city deal, you know, uh, where the ten local authorities in in, in Wales control, uh, you know, have control over half a billion pounds of of money over the next over the next twenty years. That again, uh, you know, has got metrics around uh, new, creating jobs, uh, creating uh, GVA in, in the city in in the city region. So. If it if it's a, a cultural you know, uh, economic development opportunity, what what, what can they play into? Uh, equally, um, you know, we might not be talking about cash, but we could be talking about value in kind. So uh, we're working on a project with uh, the three universities uh, in Cardiff at the moment, uh, bidding into um, uh, DCMS uh, around investing in uh, the, the cultural economy. Uh, the, the original ask from the council was, was for cash. Uh, we're providing some support in kind. So it's just thinking creatively, if you'll excuse the pun, about how we can uh, support our partners in, in, in their endeavours. And, and there are good examples out there that we're doing it.